Feature Friday. The freshest. <laughs> well, let's go watch uh, Blackpink yeah. Really and Kick It in Tokyo Rome 2020. Dome, Dome, Tokyo Dome, not at Rome. I said Tokyo Dome, didn't I? <laughs> Did I say Rome? Yes. <laughs> Sure, boy. Well, my brain just said that wrong, but my mouth felt like it said down. That makes sense. Right, I'm excited about this. Nice boots I'm excited boots by about Lisa. this. I already know they're going to be hot. Weird boots, though. They're hot. I always love... Oh, I always... I always love... I love their outfits, and I think they're always such inspirational. So when it comes to outfits, they really set trends. Like, I would wear exactly everything that Lisa's wearing right now. It's, it's just so expensive. It's so much drip they got. Yeah, but you can recreate all of this with, like, an Amazon thing. So. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Duh. Yeah, I guess. And still look as good, because it's all about the attitude, dude. Yeah, but it, yeah, I guess, I guess. You have guess to right. be thinking that you are rocking a stage. <laughs> okay? Walking down the streets Life of London. is your stage. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Ooh, my nice band. band. Nice. I'm into this. In black, they look so good. Nice. Oh, she looks so good. Well, <laughs> well goes for days, dude. English master. Look at look at the bass player. He's bumping like loving life. Look at them. They're literally having the time of their lives. It's so cool that their musicians are like grooving. Woo! Oh, weird change. Yeah. The drip in her neck. Oh my god, look at that place! <laughs> well, uh, as catch as him. You're singing a lot more now. Yeah, I know, it's really Good, cool. I love Lisa, you know. Lisa's so much fun. She's like having the time of her life every time she's on stage. Those are uh, those leggings or whatever you call them. What do you call them? I always tights. get them wrong. Tights, leggings. Tights are see-through. Yoga pants. <laughs> okay, tights are see-through. All right? right. Usually they could have patterns or whatever, but they're see-through. So they girls wore to school. Under yeah, they go under uh, your clothing. So it's like gar like undergarments. Right. Like lingerie. Yeah. Kinda. Jesus Christ! When I was in year eleven, ladies were wearing that. Yeah, you have to in certain things. Oh right. It, it it doesn't mean it's like sexy lingerie. It's just the the style of clothing oh, in the category that you would find it if you were browsing for tights. Right, but right. those ones are hot as hell. Dude. Yeah, I they're. Don't know why I find those so attractive? Well, they're cool. They have like what's it called? Encaje. Um, <laughs> encaje. Fitting. No, encaje is patterns. No, it'll come back to me. And um, yoga pants are the leggings that are super for stretchy. workout. Yeah, they're super stretchy. They're super comfortable. They don't get in the way. And leggings are a bit more like cotton made. The, or maybe those were the ones they wore because they were warmer for winter. No, there are some winter tights that are a bit thicker. Right, I see. That but also... The way she's wearing is very attractive. Oh, ¿cómo se dice encaje? I don't know. Uh, lace, that's it. Lace. That's right. What does that mean? Thank you, mom. Encaje, that's what it means. I don't know what that means. It's in Spanish. Encaje. Like what? Encaje. The pattern that she's wearing oh, is lace. So it is a pattern. Yeah, but it's a specific part in pattern called, called lace. Okay, okay. All right, can we continue now? Yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh. Dude, those boots are hard, dude. 
Same the ones that Rose are wearing as Rose, wearing as well. Blink. Woo! She's so oh, easy to look at. Yeah. It does make your head bob, doesn't it? It does! It's such a fun song! <laughs> oh, solo! She looks so good! It's such a great outfit choice! She's good looking! Dude, and people love her, dude. How could you not, people though? People love Rosé so much. Great work by the band, dude. Beautiful work. Actually, they're stealing the show. That drama is a joke. Okay, hey. can I just say, they're literally, that band made that song. Unbelievable. Outstanding! Unbelievable, yeah. There's nothing like having a live band in, in, in performances. Yeah, backing tracks are cool. Yeah, backing vocals are awesome. But having a live band with a human touch drums, with feel good basses, and like guitarists, guitarist and uh, keyboard players, and people that are there live with you, vibing with you on stage, there's nothing like it. It really brings that show from. Oh, it's cool to, oh my god, this is unbelievable. Yeah, I, I think, well, me personally, that, that would be a selling point that would push me over the edge to buy a ticket. Oh, it's like, definitely. are they going to have a live band or are they not going to have a live band? You know what I mean? That's really a selling point for me because that song, you're right, it did, again, it pushed it over the edge from being a good song to being an outstanding song uh -huh. live. That band absolutely murdered that track. Absolutely, those guys were living their best life, and you can you can like feel it, you can see it whenever you get the sneaky little shots Pretty, of the yeah, band, and they're like mate. living their best lives. It's so great. I, I'd say I'd say regardless whether I hear the studio version, I think this would always be my favorite version of all of them. I was gonna say, do they usually have a live band though? Because I've se we've seen other videos. Don't think of we've them. seen a live band. No, either. or maybe I saw them. With a live Coachella, Paris. they had one. Coachella, oh, they had Coachella, one. they had, and I think it's the same people. Mm, nice. I think it's the same people. That'd be good that they show so much loyalty. To no, the that I, that would be the way to go. I think when people change bands, it, it also changes the whole feeling and aesthetic of the whole thing. I agree. That's actually it's a good such, point. Yeah. It's such a fundamental thing. If you're touring with a live band. I think you gotta stick to those people you, for as long as you want, you, as you can. You grow closer. Your music, your your music feel grows together. Your your. I think your, there's a whole chemistry that happens. Get familiarized with things, arrangements that they like that only happened live. You didn't really arrange them. And, uh, arrange them. It's like chemistry, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's us, a very specific thing. Let us know if you've been to a Blackpink concert. What's the vibe like? What's it like? Do they always bring a live band? That drummer absolutely murdered that, mate. Absolutely. Okay, so now we've got Kick It. Yep, let's go. Well, Rose is oh really good. Oh my god, look at that place though, it's huge! It's like 30,000 people. Ooh, outfit change. We're about it, we're about the outfit changes. I've never heard these songs. Me neither. Ooh, Lisa's Lisa singing. singing as well, yeah. <laughs> Joke, mate. Again, what an outfit. Yeah, it's a hard outfit. Why is she so sweet? So weird. I like her outfit. I like her voice, man. Her Unique shirt texture. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know what I said, but I meant to say that her hair is short. <laughs> is it? She cut her hair. Oh, really? Yeah. That's what I, she looks I like now, I didn't, I didn't notice it until now. 
What's her Does name? she had Jenny. Jenny's hair is shorter yeah. in this one. Really? I just got so molded up. Actually, like Jesus' outfit, probably. The best out of everybody. I, I have in though. This I, one. Even though, like, say I was uh, sort of like, I don't know, in a fashion show or something, the one that would catch my eye would be Lisa's one. Yes. yes. Jenny's is hard because I think, I just think Jenny plays dark colors so well, man. I agree. She really suits it. Really, really well. And They're really Ro- nice, though. And Rose, what's Rose wearing? She's wearing that sort of jean sort of thing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. So? It's like a jean type of like corset slash dress, and she's wearing like a t shirt dress underneath it. But I'm telling you, dude. It, one, of, one of the people I think doesn't get enough praise, it's probably their fashion uh, uh, stylists and, uh, oh, and, the, and the people behind the scenes doing wardrobes and stuff like that. They are My so gosh. clever. They see things from like the far. It's weird how like each outfit, also you could also play devil's advocate here. The person makes the outfit to some extent, right? Yeah, true, but you need somebody to be looking at the combination together. See, say for example, because they're so individually different, and, yes. but they have elements that kind of work with each other. But if you thought of it as a concept, you wouldn't usually be like, yeah, that's perfect, mm. until you see, you saw the combination together. And also you the know? aesthetic of the whole show, yeah. the specific song. Like, what's the background, what type of feel are we going for in this in this part of the of, of the show and yeah. stuff. It's, it's really interesting. I've always really liked the, how they pick their outfit choices. Like, their stylists have really cool vision. And it's they play the similar but not so but different well we do we do know you know like chanel ambassadors uh, 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 what's the other brand that lisa does uh, oh no chanel is definitely jenny, jenny. Uh, lisa does um, we literally just watched that uh, uh, fashion show where she was present at it Ooh, yeah it was in paris i forgot Ooh. I forget. Let it, wait, I'm sure people will remind us. I want to say Montclair, but it's not. It's not Montclair. Uh, people will remind us. But, so, you know, they do really have high-end designers working behind them. So I wonder how many of those choices were specifically made for them or that specific show. Or if they have specific stylists that come from the label. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. The label has stylists that they go back and forth and with. And they arrange with this they label. They usually this, pick uh, a stylist for the group. So they have a congruent, congruent. recurrent okay. thing. Right. Yeah, so, yeah, I know that for sure. I've read it somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> Twitter. Literally. Say Sega. Yeah, true, yeah. Never knew nothing else, just a love from myself. And it could have been the one that have had to keep it. Never knew the girl when Damn. Or is it a black band? Don't know. Maybe mix above. Maybe. She sounds so good. That outfit's hot. That outfit's beautiful. So attractive. <laughs> kick it when I want to kick it. Lyrics are so substantial. <laughs> What the f- Look at that! Oh my god! <laughs> shut up, shut up! Icon, is that real? What? No, 
right, wait so a second, is this real? Just for the ones that are listening, right now. <gasps> no, shut up. It's not real. It's not real. Ah. Uh, or is it? Oh my god. So we it, and the recommendations. It just came up. Lady Gaga, Blackpink, no, Sour Candy not. music video. It's not. But it's I not. okay. So it's a, it's yeah, a fan made video. video. Right. Okay. I was about oh to. Oh my say, god! I nearly had a heart attack. I was, I was like, like, I can't believe I'm late to this. Yeah. <laughs> How did I not know about this? Yeah. Because yeah. It's May twenty eighth as well when it was released. Oh yeah. my god! It's, it has one million views as well. And it's a fan made made video. Okay. Jesus Christ. But the I thumbnail, how many people the thumbnail was so, so strong. Yeah. Oh my god, I got shook. Okay. I wonder how how many people it, it kind of had the same effect. Literally, was one million people. <laughs> one, yeah. one million people. Oh my god, <laughs> I was so shook. I literally, yeah, well, literally, I don't know how many emotions I felt in a second. It's like shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Anyways, that show conclusions. Awesome, I really like it. I don't really, I couldn't distinguish in that Kick It song whether the live band was playing, but if it was in the previous song, definitely was playing on the second one, even though there was a costume change. That doesn't mean the band packs up and goes away. No, no. So they were probably playing on top of the backing track. Maybe there were some sounds that, that kind did of not feel that did not feel like a band. I know. But there were also some sounds that did. So, so I'm very confused. Maybe maybe it was a bit of both. Bit, yeah, a mix of both. Yeah. It was really good though. Good shows. I, those outfits were absolutely incredible. And why, when this came out, I didn't know about it. Yeah, that's weird. But, like literally. And did you see that venue? How how many people were in that venue? Probably thirty thousand. <gasps> you think? I think yeah. it's more. Forty thousand maybe. It looked huge. Cause sixty thousand looks a bit. Different because it looks a bit more to up and it yeah. didn't really go that high up. But maybe this could, is more could have been spread, 60, I don't know. Maybe this is more spread out on a more horizontal type of film. All I know is that all those people say they were in sort of like a cardboard box, you could sort of just walk. Yeah, they definitely. could make a road. Yep, they wanted to. But even though I've seen too many people trying to do the whole what do you call it, dive fishing? What do you call it? Crowd, crowd diving, crowd dive, fishing, diving, <laughs> fishing. What yeah. is it, fishing? I don't know. And they sort of the crowd just vroom, the Again. sea the sea parts <laughs> and you just fall down Death. yeah <laughs> literally I've seen it so many times so I, like I, probably not the best thing it to makes do. me so nervous when people do that dude oh it's it's a rush oh talking about people if you're a dancer <laughs> sup people if you're watching this and you're a rapper or a beat producer. A singer, a ghostwriter, or even just somebody who likes new music. And this is for you. Feature Friday is the show where we make new music every week featuring your tracks, your raps, your lyrics, or yourself as an artist. There's no catch. This isn't one of those weird posts where you click on the website and you're trying to order airports and they say it's free and then you have to pay like a hundred thousand million dollars for uh, shipping. Uh, this is completely free. We understand how difficult it is in the music industry to get seen and there's so many amazing rappers and singers and beat producers out there. So this is just a place to showcase your skills. We showcase our skills, we make music every week, which we love doing anyways. We get to show new artists to new people and new people to the new artists. So if you'd like to get featured next, message me here on Instagram or email me and we will get in touch pretty soon. Please do it fast because uh, a waiting list is forming and we don't want anyone waiting around. Keep scrolling by. See you Friday. Peace. Bye-bye.